Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be putting together a plumbing toolbox. I've got a big job coming up and all my gear is not in one place, it's all over the place. So today we're going to go through together how we're going to build a toolbox and we're going to put inside the tools that I think I might need for this job. Okay, um, there'll be all different sorts of tools and, and we'll go through together, see what I've got lying about just to make up this toolbox. So I hope you enjoy the video. I've got this house. So this is my toolbox that I've just built and I'm going to take you around it and show you what I've put in it. So on the top, I've got three, three um, little storage compartments. In the middle one, I've just got a 25mm hole saw, a triangle key, and a toilet seat key for tightening and loosening toilet seats. In this part, I've just got um, spare filters and washers for taps that I service and maintain. This one, I've just got an assortment of um, joins. I've got tees, compression fit tees, elbows, 90 degree elbows, uh, isolation joints, and also just a spare couple of olives and um, some nuts. I've also got just a couple of drain off valves in there as well. You never know. Sometimes if you're taking a water sample or um, you know you can damage these valves and then they're gonna need changing at some point. So if I've got one in the box I could just change it there and then. So that is in that compartment. Moving inside the box. So uh, just a 22 inch King Kingman box. It's 15 pound. Um, so I haven't broke the bank on this one. Just in the top tray. In the top tote, I've got I've put two um, rolls of PTFE tape. I've got a 15mm um, Copex um, pipe slice. I've got a, what is this one? 4 to 22mm monument um, adjustable pipe slice. And I've got a 8 to 35mm backhoe um, pipe slice. Uh, standing knife, T25 screwdriver, small adjustable, tape measure, a lighter, a couple of allen keys, a couple of pencils, um, some standing knife blades, some flux brushes, pencil and a marker, that's in the top section. Then the bottom bit I've got my Solvent cement for PVC pipe work. I've got a pot of plumbers made, tub of flux, and just down there in the corner, some assortment of Jubilee clips. Have a hacksaw, solder, stubby Phillips screwdriver, electrical tape, brand new um, set of screwdrivers flat, two flats and two Phillips, have a 19mm and a 22mm chisel, wood chisel, my pro bar, nail cutter, pipe cutters, tube cutters for PVC tube, and I've got a new um, pipe cleaner and deburrer, Voice grips, two adjustables, eight inch, Rothenberger basin wrench, this is the telescopic one, hammer, foil, terminal screwdriver, flat stubby, a eight to nine millimeter open ended spanner, 
and a 10mm ring spanner, open end one side ring on the other, an inch scraper, get if I need to get off gaskets or anything like that, um, set of linesman pliers and a set of needle nose pliers and that is about it. You do still need to get bits and pieces for the toolbox, I need to get some grips. Uh, I didn't have any of them spare knocking around. Um, blades for the hacksaw. Uh, and then just a few other little bits and bobs that might come in handy while I'm out on a job. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye bye.